Zurich is not only an upscale banking metropolis, but also Switzerland's financial center. So it is not really a surprise that it's frequently referred to as the most expensive city in the world. The Swiss capital is known for its opulent lives, high-end shopping, and of course, exquisite chocolates. Zurich, which has highly urbanized districts nestled among historical and cultural sites, is also home to some of Europe's wealthiest people. So who are these folks, and what do they do with their time and money? Stay tuned to find out. Billionaires When Forbes released its annual list of the wealthiest people on Earth, 40 of those who made the cut were Swiss citizens. It came as no surprise that many of those folks are residents in Zurich. A closer look showed that a lot of these billionaires are an elite group from renowned affluent Swiss families who have operated international corporations for many decades. Take, for example, Margarita Louis-Dreyfus. When we think of a margarita, we imagine it frozen on a beach. We don't immediately think of a Russian-born Swiss tycoon with links to the Louis-Dreyfus family, but that's exactly who we're talking about today. Margarita Louis-Dreyfus, the Russian-born business tycoon, is perhaps the second most famous person with the Louis-Dreyfus name, as we believe that the title of first belongs to the famous TV actress Julia Louis-Dreyfus. But not that any of that matters. Margarita Bogdanova married into the Louis-Dreyfus family in 1992. She may not be the most well-known, but she certainly won the name lottery. She is not just the most renowned member of the family, but she is also intelligent, diligent, and dedicated. The wealthy businesswoman is worth an estimated $3.3 billion and is also the third richest woman in Switzerland based on her earnings. Wealthy Neighborhood Zurich is frequently named among Europe's most costly cities for a reason, and if you've ever gone there for a night out, you've probably noticed this. But get this, it is not only the beer and food that are expensive, the money spent on housing is insane. There aren't many individuals in Zurich who can afford to purchase a home, and there's a reason for that. The wealthy have staked their claim. NG Seafeld and Escher Wiss are some of the most expensive neighborhoods in Zurich. The closer you get to the city center or the lake, the more costly apartments become. However, places on Zurich's eastern side are normally more expensive than those on the north and west sides. Seafeld, which is a sought-after area on the northernest banks of Lake Zurich, is just across from NG. It's an expensive location to live in since it's a little narrow strip of a district. However, if you can afford it, you'll come to appreciate the quality of living as it is unrivaled. This small town is one of the nicest spots in Zurich to live for families. You also get to live on the banks of Lake Zurich where you may swim, boat, paddleboard, and sunbathe. The China Garden, a serene and zany sanctuary of Chinese pavilions, bridges, and architecture, is one of the most popular gathering places in Seafeld. You go next door and you find yourself in Zurichhorn, a well-liked green area featuring a play area, an outdoor theater, and many nice spots to unwind. Compared to NG, Seafeld is generally a little more residential, tranquil, and laid back. Because of this, it's not the ideal area in Zurich to look for employment. But if you can afford the high prices, it's an excellent area to raise children. The convenient proximity to Hull's school, which many consider to be the best international school in the city, is one of the biggest benefits for families in this area. Leaving the busy and commercial areas of the city and entering the more natural areas, NG is our top choice if you're searching for parks, trees, and a quiet little life in Zurich. It's one of the most picturesque areas in the heart of Zurich, bordering both Ossersill and District 1. As you undoubtedly already know, Zurich is located on the northern banks of the sizable Lake Zurich, one of the most well-known and accessible natural attractions in the country. Because of this, NG is incredibly well-liked by everyone from swimmers to cyclists to hikers to sunbathers and everyone in between. Regardless of the lack of beaches and the distance from the Mediterranean coast, NG has a rather Mediterranean vibe. NG is one of the nicest areas in Zurich for families due to its beautiful scenery and relaxing atmosphere. It is ideal for families with children because it offers wonderful green spaces, low pollution levels, and even top-notch schools. Swiss International School, one of the most well-known schools in the area, is among the best. Although NG isn't the most affordable neighborhood in Zurich to raise children, if you happen to be a multimillionaire who values your family's well-being, this is the place for you. The rich folks in Zurich know how to do it big, from massive garages to massive mansions with various swimming pools. The aesthetics of the residents are usually spectacular and breathtaking, with floor-to-ceiling windows overlooking stunning blue lakes. Practically every property is futuristic, with cutting-edge smart gadgets like those automatic doors and lights you see in the movies. If you need to cool down after a hard day's work, all you have to do is simply walk a few feet and enter your own personal sauna or spa. 
These billionaires even have their own private cinemas where they can catch the latest blockbusters on supersized screens. Hotels Zurich offers a diverse choice of housing alternatives, from ultra-luxurious hotels to sleek and modern boutique hotels. In fact, there are so many fantastic places to stay here that it may be difficult to choose just one. But before you decide where you'd want to stay, keep in mind that you will need to have enough money in your wallet because these hotels are guaranteed to burn a hole in your pocket. The Sorel Hotel Seafield is one of these hotels, enjoys a great location in the center of Zurich, close to Lake Zurich Shores, and is only a short stroll from the city's most well-known attractions. The Bonhofstrasse, the Zurich Opera House, the Zurich Art House, and the Zurich Old Town are all close by. The guest rooms include striking colors, gorgeous wallpaper, and incredibly cozy box spring beds that are inspired by the Art Deco era. Because they have designated family rooms, the Sorel Hotel Seafield is a great place to stay if you're traveling with a family. They feature age-appropriate toys, family-friendly activities, and coloring books so everyone can enjoy themselves. Much cooler than ordinary family rooms. Storch in Zurich is like a villa on its own, and it is a good choice if you want hotels that have it all. From fine dining to fashionable bars to a luxurious spa and cutting-edge fitness facility, you won't have to leave your hotel if you don't want to. There are several places to select from if you get hungry, including the modern bar-style bruschetta and the Riverside Terrace. Next, on the other hand, is possibly the finest of the bunch. This rooftop eatery, which is only open during the warmer months, offers stunning views of the city, as well as a wonderful menu of modern Swiss meals and inventive cocktails. If you wish to improve your fitness while you're away, the personal trainer at the hotel's gym will assist you. If all you want to do is relax, jump aboard the hotel's boat and sail towards the Alex Spa for some love and attention. Restaurants Zurich Cuisine has enjoyed success through the perfection of traditional Swiss dishes, as well as the addition of modern elements. This city is the place to be if you want to eat a traditional fondue or some fresh seafood on the lake's edge. Zurich has undergone a healthy transformation in terms of restaurant selection in recent years. There are numerous superb restaurants, both old and new, that are currently shaping the city's culinary culture. The more flashy end of the range is making waves, with the likes of Dazzling Razia leading the pack. There's also the ambitious Maison Monestime, which combines trendy settings with a daring menu. The Croton Hall in Zurich is one of the country's most recognized restaurants. The restaurant's exquisite decor displays artistic masterpieces by Picasso, Chagall, and Mir. And customers will feel transported back in time. It has also built up a reputation for world-class Swiss cuisine and regional specialties. The neighboring bar is regarded as one of the best on the planet and is well worth a visit before partaking in the exceptional traditional meals. Dining out in Zurich is expensive, and there is still a market for eating experiences that mix attractive surroundings and value for money, particularly for those with children. If money isn't a barrier, then whether it's a Michelin-starred cookery or a schnitzel the size of a whole plate, the city can compete with the best. So if this city sounds like your vibe, it's better to move quickly, but remember to go with a stack of cash because nothing comes cheap. Also, make sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content.